I'm Luke Nguyen, a Vietnamese Australian chef in a very beautiful but remote part of Vietnam. I'm here to meet the local people, try their delicious food and learn how they cook it. I'm really looking forward to seeing a very small part of what Australia has been doing to support the Vietnamese people and improve their livelihoods. Now I'm on my way to a small village called Tong Cao, which is home to the Thai ethnic minority group. This is the home of Miss Lin and her husband, Mr. Fung, participants in an Australian government project aimed at strengthening the voice of ethnic minority women, improving their livelihoods, and reducing gender inequality. Implemented by Care International. Các nghiên cứu ở Việt Nam hiện nay đã chỉ ra rằng là À, đói nghèo của Việt Nam thì đã giảm đáng kể. Tuy nhiên thì cái hiện trạng đấy ở trên miền núi vẫn còn rất là nặng nề. Thế thì à, về về miền núi thì đối với những người dễ bị tổn thương nhất thì đấy chính là các chị em người phụ nữ dân tộc thiểu số. Đó chính là lý do vì sao tổ chức Ke đã có một cái chương trình rất lớn đây là nâng quyền cho phụ nữ người dân tộc thiểu số. <cười> người ở đây anh chị làm nghề gì? Ở đây thì công việc chính của anh chị là nhà nông làm ruộng. Like most people in this province, they are a farming family. They showed me their chickens, ducks and pigs that they raise behind their house. Do you have many children? Do you have many children? I love how... Um, you know, the, the work is distributed, you know. Jilin feeds the chickens and the ducks. Fung feeds the pigs. It's a really, it's a real husband and wife job. Now, Miss Ling has told me about a very special event that's happening at her house. I mean, all the village women have come. I'm really looking forward to seeing what it's all about. Because Miss Ling's house is quite large, it sometimes doubles up as a meeting place. But what's special about this community meeting is that all the participants are women. I feel very fortunate and lucky to be able to be here in the northern mountains in this um, ethnic village to, to experience this. <laughs> Miss Liang is part of a women's savings and loans group supported by the Australian government. For people who don't earn much cash or have many material possessions, it can be quite difficult to save money let alone take out a loan. Here, each woman makes a contribution to a savings fund for use if someone is sick or injured and a credit fund which women can borrow money from. Everyone decides together as a group who gets that loan and that loan is used to buy crops, it's used for farming or even start a new business. I'm really glad I got to experience that. I was really impressed in how organised it was. Um, how professional it was as well. And now I'm really interested to see how much the ladies can borrow and um, and what they use that money for. Julian, cái uh, thì nào mình mượn tiền á, mình mượn khoảng bao nhiêu được một lần? Mỗi một uh, quý thì mượn là 5 triệu. 5 triệu. Wow, cũng nhiều á. Rồi uh, cái 5 triệu mình xài cho cái gì chị? Để um, chăn nuôi hoặc trồng trọt. À vâng. Mua cám chăn uh, nuôi. À. Hai là phân bón để uh, now I'm off to the fields with Jilin. She's going to show me all the different types of crops. Trước kia thì đất chị trồng đũa một vụ, chưa có dự án, bây giờ có dự án rồi chị 
à, trồng khoai à, chị Linh, chị Linh mượn khoảng bao nhiêu tiền để uh, trồng mấy cái cây này? À, trên uh, 2.000m2 thì chị mượn 2 triệu thì đầu tư uh, trồng khoai Wow, yeah. Chị uh, mua đạm đơn kali trong uh, một vụ khoai của chị trên yeah. 2.000m thì chị sẽ thu được uh, 12 triệu It's great to see what these women have been able to achieve thanks to this credit group which has allowed them to save and borrow money to buy better seedlings and fertilizers for their crops. Now it's two crops per year, rice and sweet potato. I think it's fantastic and sustainable. Now this is my biggest inspiration coming to remote areas like this in the northern mountains of Vietnam and seeing what they're cooking, what produce they're using and learning so much from the local people. Now it seems like they love all of their roots and all their aromas. There's lots of galango there, lots of lemongrass and fresh herbs. So I thought I'm going to make a dish for them because they're cooking such an amazing menu there. Now I have Dang here from Koto. You're going to help me, yeah? Yes, of course. Yeah? Um, I'm using all the fresh herbs, right? Vietnamese cuisine is all about freshness, isn't it? Fresh rau rum, we've got some lemon leaves, I've got dill, I've got coriander, lemongrass, anything that's been inspired from what I've seen today. So can you help me with this one? Yes, can you just course. please pound um, the turmeric, the galangal, the lemongrass and the garlic all together? I want to make a really nice paste, okay? Ciao. Ciao. I'm going to throw in some spring onion. Cái là món hơi lạ nha. So cái này là món em lấy cá. Em bầm uh, riền, uh, nghệ, tỏi, xả, uh, nhiều gia vị. Em cuốn lá chuối, thì em hấp. Uh, sure, of course. I'm gonna put three little incisions in there, just so it evenly cooks, both sides. I'm gonna do the same, but I'm not gonna slice, I'm just gonna throw it in there. Thank you very much for your help. Now if you look at this, look at this paste, right? Look at the color. Beautiful color. Cut the fish with all this goodness. Roll, wrap. Okay, bia bình hấp nha. That goes in. Perfect fit. Now all you need with this one is probably around 12 to 14 minutes because it's around 800 grams. It's a whole fish. I've wrapped it in banana leaf. I want to cook it perfectly. Okay. Ăn nha. Lên đầu ăn nha. Fantastic time here in Denver. I mean, the landscape is so stunning. The people are extremely friendly, and I've been really impressed with the economic growth of the local Thai ladies here. I mean, their empowerment has been absolutely fascinating. I've tried incredible food made by all the gorgeous fresh produce of the land here. Everything's grown locally. Now, my next stop is Lao Cai, another province in the northern mountains of Vietnam, where I'm going to visit another project that's supported by the Australian government. I'm having such an awesome time.